Welcome, friends, to day 20, December 20th, 2023, of Exit the Game, the Advent Calendar, the Silent Storm, with 24 exciting riddles. Um, first things first, I feel we were a little harsh yesterday. <laughs> See, I don't think we were harsh. We just said we didn't like it. We didn't go off. I don't... Do I not remember? <laughs> there might have been a BS or two. <laughs> Oh, see, no. I don't think that was fair. I think it just wasn't our favorite puzzle yeah. so far this year, which we're allowed to have favorites yeah. and not favorites. I didn't think we were, were too harsh. Okay. I still don't love that one, but it, it was fine. I think it, I think it was an, actually a good puzzle, but yeah, it just wasn't We're our, just dumb. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we're not smart enough for it. Uh, oh, no. What? Well, oh, I wrote the wrong day. I can't be trusted. I'm assuming that's 20? Which one's not been opened? This one. That one? Okay. Oh, yeah, that was the... Uh... Sorry. Put oops. Oops. <laughs> oops it easy. No one can read that. Well, I can. <laughs> okay, cool. Anyway, December 20th. Let's get the story going. You got your scissors? Because allegedly so, we're going to need that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, and I'll probably take a picture of this before you okay. destroy it. Okay. <clears throat> 20th of December. You step through the next door and look around fascinated. You've still not found the command center, but seem to have made a dream of yours come true. You've landed in the hollow room. How cool! You've been desperate to see this place from the inside. It has always impressed you how the boss uses Christmas magic to bring the craziest future technologies into the here and now. He's really on the ball. You look around and smile dreamily. The boss uses the same hologram drive to make his beloved fir trees appear outside the workshop. Of course, real firs wouldn't stand a chance in the temperatures here at the South Pole. However, the Christmas ambiance is so important to him that he digs deep into his bag of tricks. That, however, is a whole different story. What's, <coughs> pardon me, what's he doing here in the hollow room goes far beyond the decorative purposes. This is where the route for, of the Christmas sleigh is planned. After all, it has to be recalculated every year because no Christmas Eve is the same as another. There are always new wishes, different gifts, amended delivery addresses, and of course, always the time pressure. You need to be absolutely on top of your logistical plans. Without the hollow room, the boss would be lost and wouldn't stand a chance of getting all the gifts to their destinations on time. This hollow science is a true miracle. Even if you have never understood all the scientific details, you always have greedily devoured the stories about it. With slightly tingling hands, you check the thumping of your heartbeat and absentmindedly mumble a few words that spring to mind like computer and energy. You approach the console in the center of the room, press a button, and immediately a sea of lights, light rays breaks out of the machine. You look enthusiastically at the crazy pattern of lines, numbers, and arrows that cover the walls like a web. Please turn the page, then open at door 20. That is coming up. That we will... is terrifying. Yeah, we're going to have to cut that out. <laughs> but before we cut it out, I need to take a picture of this. Shall I open door 20? Uh, yeah, you might as well do that. If I'd been smart, I would have looked up uh, what, we, what we had coming and prepped a little. There's one card. I don't know what's in the box yet. <clears throat> it says the hologram program calculates the ideal route for the Christmas sleigh. Every year, this route changes, although the starting point is naturally always the same. You need to carefully input the 3D vector program. Oh, I didn't read the bolded things louder. Well, then oh. try better. Try better. <laughs> try better. <laughs> the route for this year... We're going to do awesome. ...will be suggested <laughs> automatically once the program has started. Make note of the arrows that you encounter on your journey. I'm scared. I'm scared too. Okay, well, you're busy. I'm going to look at the box. Okay, you look at the box. Oh, we're losing post-it still. <laughs> Start. Oh, dear. Is there lots of stuff in there? Nope. It's just, it says start on the floor with an arrow pointing to the back of the, the room. Cool. That's it. Cool. Yeah. Okay, so okay should I cut this out Take a look at this, now? and then I will... Oh, Get the camera going. Oh, that's 19. Oh, I need 20. Why is that not? What's the matter? The door wasn't opening. 
I think can't even open the door, right? This is going to be yeah. great today. This is bullcrap. <laughs> <laughs> Kidding. We're just dumb. It's fine. I think we've been on too good of a run. Yeah. We had to be got, brought back to... Yeah, probably. I think we've done really well this year. I think honestly. we have too. <clears throat> okay, so let's take a look inside here. There is not much on that side. Same with that side. And then, yeah, picture the planet. Oh, start. Yeah. That, oops, I dropped something. That might be important. So I will add that to my, my photographic evidence. <clears throat> the kitty scissors leave a little to be desired. <laughs> Okay, I assume we have to fold this, right? It's going to be like a... I don't know. Okay, so what does it say? I feel like we need to fold it. The hologram... I feel we probably do. Um, the hologram program calculates the ideal route for Christmas for the Christmas sleigh. Every year, this route changes, although the starting point is naturally, is naturally always the same. <gasps> this goes in the room. Um, <laughs> the route for this year will be suggested automatically once the program has started. Make note of the arrows that you encounter on your journey. Okay, I'm do you need to do you need to like it. cut it to size because you didn't cut the dotted lines? Well, okay. Miss, will... this goes in the room. <laughs> Sorry, I was really. You got excited, excited there. <laughs> It was just so obvious all of a sudden. I had to I had to share. <laughs> <laughs> so this is less bull crap now? Well, I'm not gonna commit to that yet. <laughs> we don't know what we're in for just yet. Then probably cut the uh, Oh, oh, I've totally failed. Yep. I know the dotted lines are hard to see. <laughs> Again, I really should wear my glasses. <laughs> I really, really. On that note, I think that was another problem with yesterday. I had the wrong glasses on. Yeah, totally. So I was wearing these glasses. Yeah. <laughs> these ones here. <laughs> like they care. <laughs> <laughs> and today I've got my my smart man glasses on, so we're gonna use those. Okay, I'm gonna <clears throat> fold this. Oh, it's very difficult to fold inward when you don't know where you're going. So I will fold outward first. Is there a certain spot where the arrow for start is? Yeah. It's in the middle. <clears throat> like I think it's gonna go like that because that's where the start is. Mm, no, the start's kind of right dead center. That's probably the start. I think it goes in with the air like exactly like this. Oh, is that a finish flag or a start flag? I think that's the finish. Oh, all right. Look, I had the the biggest part I figured look, out, look, so look, you look do look the look. rest. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so, oh, I guess we're, oh my god, we got to trace this. Oh, this is going to be a fun one to watch, folks, because I don't know how we're going to do this. <laughs> okay. Um, we, I need, you... like, a pencil or something. I need to just I follow. have a pencil right there. I okay. thought it was a pen. Um, okay, so we're going to start here, because that's where it said the start was. Mm -hmm. We're going to go there. And we're going to follow this. Let's just keep following this. And then we're going to get a number, right? Uh, not yet. Then we're going to go down to nine. Then what? Then you keep going. Oh, but which direction? Keep going in the direction. Same direction? You, yeah. Okay, so nine was our first number. Then we're going to go here. And then we're going to go here. Yeah, no one's going to be able to see this. Then we're <laughs> going to go up to another nine. Okay. And we're going to go here, here. If it ends at the flag, I think we've done it right. Oh my goodness. This is a long thing, Santa. Nine. No. Nine, nine, nine. But we end up at the finish line. Do Let's see. try it? Oh my goodness, <clears throat> I don't know. Down, across, up. Oh my god. Okay. We are smart today. This was the best puzzle ever. 
the greatest one they've ever created. <laughs> Actually, it was this. pretty clever. I probably would have put that in wrong to start with, honestly. I I would have put the flag at the bottom. I thought it was a start flag. So no. that's the only thing that would have... Um, okay, so I'm that. actually going to take this out because nobody saw what I did. No, I didn't see you yet. I'm sitting right here. <laughs> okay, so as my lovely partner has said, this fit perfectly into the room. This turns it into a room. This arrow down here coincides with the start arrow that's right on the floor right there. So this is our start arrow and we basically follow it along. So we start here, here, come here. Uh, we come to this arrow, we came here, which then comes up this wall here, which comes up to here. This arrow takes us down to the nine. That was our first nine. Continue following it. This arrow then comes this way, goes up. Yeah, it's confusing when it's not in the shape. Wait a minute. But I think they get oh, it. Oh, yeah, I know. No. Come up. Then we end up at this nine here. Continue up here, blah, blah, blah. And eventually we end it up. It did end up with the flag, hey? Yeah. Um, how did I end up with the other nine? Oh, yeah. Then we end up with this nine. And then over here, up here, up here. So essentially, you're tracing the arrows from here in every direction it tells you to go until you get to the finish line. The 999 was tricky. The 999 <laughs> threw me. I thought, I thought we, sure were we were wrong. wrong. <laughs> but uh, no, this one... We think all the ones we get are great. Yeah, I know. We think that all the other ones are bullcrap. But actually, <laughs> no, like I said, I think the other one actually was good. We just weren't... It wasn't... Our brain didn't click with that one. But this one, as soon as you said it was a room, that was clever. Um well, thanks. That, uh, That's I didn't, a short one. That was a short one. <laughs> I didn't even have time to... I didn't even look at it close enough to know what it was going to do. Um, that's it. So we're getting into the final countdown. Oh. Did you mark... Yeah. 21? I did. I really had to think about it. <laughs> <laughs> we are getting towards the very end of our uh, adventure. A few more days to go. Um, let us know how you guys are getting on with this. But uh, I'm enjoying this year. Quite a bit, yeah, actually. Yeah, I would do it again next year. Yeah. Assuming yeah. they produce one. Well, this is the third year they've done it. There's one we didn't do because we didn't know they we existed. We didn't know it existed, but, yeah. Um, so, do you want to tell them to do the things? Oh, okay, wait. Uh, <laughs> this one's right here. Do the things. Uh, watch those ones. Up here. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, Kate, yeah, watch those because that's our previous adventures where we're so, so, so smart. And YouTube thinks you will like, Oh, Lord, this is hard. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fired, aren't I? No, you're, you're not yet. We'll see. We'll see. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye. Bye.